Well, high school football teams facing off against each other at Dallas Stadium tonight while health officials try to play defense against the coronavirus. School District 2 decided this morning to allow two visiting fans per player at football games. Parents attended tonight's game between Senior and Bozeman with COVID-19 safety protocols of using masks and distancing. Q2's David J was there. The Senior High Bronx get introduced at Dallas Stadium. Two fans may attend for each player and any student involved, and the latest decision allows the visiting team to have fans. We were a little concerned about how we were going to manage uh, fans from Bozeman tonight who are outside of the stadium and kind of felt like maybe it was a good idea to, to uh, put them in the stands. It's wide open up there. Um, and, and our experience with our fans over the last couple of weeks has been good. A few less fans in the stands, but a lot of enthusiasm, still a lot of energy out there. And it's important for both the players and the parents to be out here tonight. I'm sure I'm glad they're allowing spectators. That yeah. would have been uh, mm -hmm. really tough on the kids and the parents if they hadn't. Yeah, yep, I'm glad that we are able to see them play and yeah. that they have somebody watching them. So, yeah, I think it's a good thing. I think it's great that they kind of open it up, but still, you know, being safe. So I'm glad they found, uh, you know, some level ground so that parents can still come out and watch. Outside, students who could not get into the stadium still cheered for their friends. We got a good show out tonight. We weren't really expecting this, honestly. And since we can't go on the bleachers, we thought might as well just go on the fence on Pioneer Park, which is kind of cool. And everyone showed out tonight. We're still getting more people coming, but no, it's exciting. It's better than not watching the game at all. I mean, it's pretty good to watch the friends that you had in uh, high school and way back, even in elementary, out there playing. The school district 2 COVID-19 protocols have worked so far and could change. Go Bronx! In Billings, David J, MTN News. All right, thank you, Dave.